M0 FXB Andreas UK. M0 FXB. We'll quickly look at these GPS functions. So you're in normal mode. You hit this button. You go into the GPS menu or screen. So if you just tap the middle, you're going to get this screen which shows all the satellites here. You've got your date, your position, your altitude. You, this is called like the angle of satellites. It's a very neat screen. If you tap the middle, then you're showing this menu. And if you tap the small man here, you're going to see the station that's talking or last talked and their distance. My GPS, as you can see, is locked. You can turn that on in GPS settings. Now, if you're going to sort of try and track someone, you go into this, see this arrow here at the bottom, you go into like the navigation menu. Yeah, so this is how you navigate. So how, how to how to use that. So go back to the, um, this person has been speaking, EA7, and now hit memory, and see the way it starts flashing? Well, hit one of those two, so hit L1, and it stalls his position. You can see the little green man's appear there. So let's go back to navigation menu. And let's hit L1 again. Now, I'm, as far as I know, I can now go towards him and find him. And then I think you can store more than one. So earlier I did store a different station in L2. So let's go back by just touching the screen. Back again. So there's the little man. So look, someone just transmitted there, J4 ETA. So if I want to track him, I hit memory. I've just stored him in L1. Go back to track. Hit L1 again. Look, he comes back on the screen. And now I can track towards him. So that's what I've worked out that the FT3 does when it's in GPS. I think it's very nifty. M0FXB.